This is a video abstract for the review pharmacological interventions for treating chronic prostatitis, chronic pelvic pain syndrome. My name is Juan Franco. I'm from the Instituto Universitario Hospital Italiano in Argentina. And this is a Cochrane review from the Cochrane Urology Review Group. Chronic prostatitis and chronic pelvic pain syndrome is a complex disorder that affects up to 10% of men in their lifetime when the average age of 42 years old and is characterized by pelvic pain and urinary symptoms in more than three months of the past six months. The objective of this review was to assess the effects of pharmacological therapies for chronic prostatitis, chronic pelvic pain syndrome. We used standard Cochrane methods searching multiple databases in July 2019 and included randomized controlled trials of men suffering from this condition and all pharmacological interventions. Assessing the risk of bias of these included studies and drafting grade summary of findings table. We screened over 1,700 records and included 99 studies. The quality of the evidence for most comparisons was low to very low. And in many cases, these interventions may reduce prostatitis symptoms. However, some of these reductions may not cross minimal clinically important differences thresholds. We were limited by the short-term follow-ups in the majority of studies, the high risk of bias in the included studies, the unexplained inconsistency in results, for example, on those comparing alpha blockers to placebo, the small sample size of the included study that led to imprecision, and that our search for traditional Chinese medicine might not be comprehensive because we did not include Chinese databases. Findings from low to very low quality evidence indicate that some interventions such as alpha blockers may reduce the prostatitis symptoms with an increased incidence of minor adverse events such as dizziness and hypotension, while others were found to be ineffective. 